Welcome back everybody, it's your Thunder Chicken, back with another episode of Game Dev Tycoon. Completing lots of contracts. And gaining lots of money. Okay, um, let's, what else can we do? What, like, uh, let's see what we can do for research. We need a ton of research. Let, let. Let's find some contract work. Alien research? I don't think we can do that yet. Okay, so we need to develop a game then. Uh, let's see. Uh, what, do, what do we want? It's gonna be our first game of the day. What's gonna be our first one? A romance adventure game, and it's gonna, it's gonna be on the Mbox 360. It's gonna be an amazing title. It's gonna be called uh, Two Hearts, and it's gonna be Reach Out and Touch Base. I think that one's our a really good one here. Wait, what? What? Did I not? Okay. Two hearts. It's gonna be a romance adventure game. The Nbox 360. A touch base. Next. Honestly. Okay. So, let's see. Uh, we are gonna... Now, Two Hearts Romance Adventure. Story quests are most important. Gameplay at the least. Engine's gonna be up there though. I don't think we've never made an adventure game. We'll try it out. Okay, development two. Dialogue's very important. Level design, equally as important. Artificial intelligence, less likely than important. Let's get that design in there. I don't know if this is gonna be good. I don't know, would sound be more? Let's, the sound is less important. Let's get this guy on. Oh no. Edgar Nelson is like going nuts. We might have to ask him for this one. He's gonna be our guy. He knows how to do it. He might be a little bit stressed, but that's all right. I believe in our teammates. It's all about believing in your teammates. Let's see. Let's see. This is probably gonna be the worst game we've ever come up with. We're gonna we're we're just gonna hype it up too. 47 bugs? I think that's officially the biggest. Let's hype our crappy game up. Come on. More of everything. Let's go. Get rid of that bug, please. And we just got rid of that bug at the end. I love it. I love it. Come on. Let's 
special training. No loading screens. Okay. You, sir, are gonna go on vacation. Uh, me? I mean, that's not bad for, like, just trying to make something. Send on vacation. Send on vacation. You're gonna generate our game report, Mr. Chicon! And then... Oh, man. It takes a lot of research. Yeah... Today, Grapple, the company responsible for the massively successful gr gr Graphone. Graphone. I just know. Is it Great Phone? They're planning to release a tablet called the Grad. I, I'm just not even going to say it. It's just terrible. Two hearts. Yeah, we're the best. We're kind of sort of all right. Let's, uh, can we, can we? No, we don't want to do that. Can we find contract work? Let's let these guys work on contract work while Mr. Chicken Owen's working on other stuff. I mean, we've sold more than 500,000 on that game. I I'm kind of intrigued. Oh no. That's a lot of stuff. We got the following results. Can a roman a romance and adventure is a great combination. Artificial intelligence seems not to be important. Okay, so we got that. Platform genre match, good. Uh, audience match good top so we did good on that it's probably just the bars that we got everything wrong is what i'm thinking probably could have been a little bit better that's all right we are not gonna finish this i'm just doing it for the research though Usability study. Cause we want to get the we want to get the best in the game. Sir, minus one in technology. We just did so damn good that we got. We 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 did too good, guys. We did too good. Okay. Let's find contract work. Logo animation. I think I'm gonna have people do some uh, some studying after this. Game on. You, you go on vacation. Decrypt! Uh... No, we don't like that stuff. We believe in a fair market around here at Thunder Chi Energy. And character design. Get these out of the way. Uh, 11 million? Oh no, uh, 800,000. Right on. Okay, so. Then let's, let's get these guys some training. So, he can do game design. But I feel like this guy should be doing, okay, which is the best? These are the best. Let's just give these guys so we don't know what they do yet so we'll have to go through and kind of see what they do here uh, product management and then R&D course it takes 30 RP though to do each one of those special boost and I mean it's never a bad thing to have all of your people training so let's just have everybody train in on game design let's see what our main guy can do train uh, let's have him do game design everybody's gonna do a little bit of training here and then once uh, this guy like reaches 500 I think that we can have certain skill like actual boosts like so we'll be able to make a better game than normal with that boost activated and it's kind of like a special ability a 
Okay, so. What do people want? Let's find a publishing deal. Any topic action. Werewolf any genre. Or we can make a werewolf. Uh, make a role playing game. What should we call our role-playing game with werewolf? Uh, aftermath. Make a text-based game. Like we'll bring back text-based games. We'll do Dungeons and Dragons. Okay, uh, so werewolf role-playing game. Role-playing game. Hmm. Gonna go with that. Strong audience for everyone. So we're gaining some hype because of that. Hi, this is Andrew McNarna from the Game Informant. I got word that Thunder Chi Energy is working on a new game. Would you be willing to share some information? Sure, why not? Many of our readers are curious about what decisions go into making a video game and how companies prioritize development areas. Your new game is a werewolf RPG game. Can you tell us where uh, such a game would receive more focus on level design or on sound? I would probably say role playing game. Uh, more on sound? Whatever. Screw the other guys. We're uh, at Thunder Chi Energy. We're all about different. Okay, so that kind of gives us an idea that sound is important in this game. So dialogues. A role playing game. Let's make our artificial intelligence a little bit higher. Try that. I know I'm just kind of shooting stuff up my butt. Let's see. Let's see if it's any good. We got 60.4 million. We can afford to make mistakes. Okay. Graphics. Sound. Sounds very important. Graphic is important. Question mark. I would say. hard to say yeah let's just do that wow the years kind of go further apart by the looks of it It seems like they're going faster, like we're spending more time making games than anything. 850,000, that's a little bit more than we had last time. And... thank you. New records for everyone! Release game. Whopper to play. Research. Oh, no. It ain't shite, but it ain't good. <laughs> Has its moments. We might have to pay them for this one. Oh well, we still get the royalties from it. Uh, you generate game report. Let's do some contract work. We got a good team, that's for sure. <clears throat> yeah, we're the best, we know. 
Uh, <clears throat> it meets the required workings. Perfect. Wow. <laughs> way to do this is you send them all on vacation at the same time at the start and then they just it doesn't take that long stop making me look bad it doesn't take that long right uh, actually let's do some new topic research airplane research crap Abstract. I wonder what an abstract game would be like. Maybe like a walking simulator, I guess. I don't know. Horror. Yes. Health. Evolution. Let's see. What else can we make? Transport? Today my Knopf has received their no, they're making tablet. Tablet. Tablet computer type deal. Some scratching your head. Come on, come on with the idea. Do the thing. Woo! I said, woo! Come on. Thank you. Develop new game. Pick topic. Let's do transport. And we'll make it a simulation. It's gonna be on the PC. It's PC Master Race. It's gonna be with touch base. It's gonna be called Trains. With capital T because I'm not a barbarian. Yes, yes. Gameplay. Stories and quest. Yes. Right there, seventy-five percent. Engine. All right. Let's build this game. Oh yeah, the woo. I don't think they had this one in here the last time I was playing. I don't think so. It was, it was a pretty cool idea, but I mean, I don't know. It was it was different. See, that's the thing like Nintendo's really good at is they're definitely good at making different things, but I don't I think they should focus on It's funny because they make different they try different ideas with consoles, but they don't try different ideas with their with their games. And I don't I, you know, that's not a bad thing, but it's definitely not a good thing either. Artificial intelligence in a simulation. Uh, yeah, I think that would be pretty good. It's like, I mean, how many times can we play Legend of Zelda, right? I like now that our bubbles are in, they're getting like two or three or four. This is where I like, this is where the fun part of the game really <clears throat> hits for us. World design, not so much. Graphics, yes. Sound, yes. Yeah, we'll go with that. Go, go. No! It has a bug. 
people might exploit it. Not bad! We did it good! Yeah, and this one's all ours. We don't even have to pay royal. Uh, we don't even get royalties or anything from this. It's all our money. Oh, yeah. Oh. Thank you very much, everybody, for joining us in the latest episode of Game Dev Tycoon. Feel free to leave a like, comment, or subscribe if you like what you're seeing and want to see more, or you just want to leave some friendly feedback. This is Thunder Chicken, signing out. Bye bye. Have a great day.